What's up guys? Do you own a home? Do you have foundation issues? Do you ever wonder how a foundation on the house works? I'm gonna make a quick video explaining how. Steve on I'm on a construction site and I wanted to make a quick video explainer explaining how these foundations work um, first of all I mean obviously the frame that goes around are your forms that's what holds the concrete in place when it's poured all this plastic black plastic is a vapor barrier <clears throat> basically keeps moisture from getting up into your house into the concrete uh, once the concrete's cured so all these giant holes are your piers now on the outside of this foundation these are all looks like 24 inch deep piers 12 inches wide so that's gonna all that extra concrete that's poured into those holes supports the weight of these two-story townhouse condo things whatever you want to call these i don't know but uh anyway that's just sometimes people don't really explain you know like when i'm selling patio covers why i tell them they can't use their four inch slab to build a you know a 20 by 20 patio cover it's because that concrete will break you got to have all this concrete and when they dig down into these holes they dig these these trenches out for these piers they're digging down to the undisturbed soil that's very important they're they're reaching down below the top layer they're digging down below the top layer down to the soil that's been undisturbed for i don't know thousands of years maybe i don't know um, anyway, and if they do do digging, they have to compact it and they got to run, you know, big heavy machinery around and they got to make sure that soil down is compacted. So they're digging down to the undisturbed soil, 24 inches by 12 inches concrete pier. This is going to all the way around this structure is going to support the load of this house and the roof and all the exterior walls. And then this middle pier is going to support the load of the, the the load bearing walls that run down the middle of these these structures you know all the inside of these houses have load bearing walls unless you have a truss style roofing system but most houses nowadays in america are stick framed and they have load bearing walls in the middle and this is all designed to support the load of that house so anyway i hope that helps explain some things about foundations got a whole bunch of houses being built over here but uh, anyway, if you would like, share, subscribe, please. Uh, I'm going to keep making videos, doing explanations on, on different steps of um, construction. Um, and there you go. Have a good one. Thank you.